A scary moment for parents in the Licking Valley School District Friday as the school was placed on lockdown for a possible active shooter situation, which turned out to be fake. Sheriff Randy Thorpe shared that the 911 call came in just before 11 and the caller, a male, named a specific room number saying shots were fired. Again, this was a swatting call, a fake call. Sheriff Thorpe added Licking County Sheriff's Office will be working with state agencies to find the responsible party and have reached out to the FBI. Thorpe says a person with good intentions showed up at the scene armed and was detained. That person knew someone inside of the building. Thorpe couldn't tell us how they were related. Now, Sheriff Thorpe says this was a very traumatic experience for the entire community. That doesn't uh, relieve everyone of the of the trauma and the stress. Uh, you know, we have deputies trying to clear the building. We have parents showing up and, and I can totally understand the parents and their feelings and what they're going through. <laughs> Sheriff Thorpe saying his office will have a debriefing meeting, which will include what can be done better if this uh, were to ever happen again. And law enforcement agencies dealt with fake swatting calls across the state Friday morning. In addition to Licking Valley in Newark, Cristo Ray Columbus High School here in the capital city also said someone made a false report of shots fired. Columbus did respond there and quickly gave the all clear. Chillicothe police say they received a similar call Friday afternoon at Chillicothe High School. And similar reports in at least eight other cities Friday from Cincinnati to Cleveland all cleared without issues.